How do you know when you like someone, or even love someone, if you keep thinking of them? It's the same in science. If you're really interested in a question, then that is the greatest motivation. I'm Ji Jie Chai, a structural biologist. Life in Beijing happens at a very fast pace. The university is not secluded from the world outside, but life on campus is different, easier. 60 million people, 30 million cars. Beijing is a giant metropolis, and Gigi Chai crosses it each morning on foot just because he would take just as long by car. Chai is one of the leading experts researching the protein structure and receptors that play a deciding role in the immune defense, in plants and animals. For his research in China, he could already make use of a new and advanced imaging technique. Cryo-electron microscopy offers scientists many possibilities to analyze the structure of large biological molecules and ultimately explain their function. This will change cellular biology in the foreseeable future. In cryo-electron microscopy, the object is cooled down close to absolute zero with liquid hydrogen or helium. The sudden freezing helps to maintain the spatial structure of all cell components. Then, an electron microscope is used to take pictures of the object from various angles and levels. These images are then put together into a three-dimensional image of the molecular structure. The result is a look at the world at the molecular level. For me, when it comes to work, there's no real difference between China and the rest of the world. We acquire knowledge and explore the unknown. Borders never held much meaning for Chai. He started as a chemist, did his doctorate at the medical faculty in Beijing. Then he went into molecular biology. The easy switch across these different fields demonstrates how Chai's area of research could be applied to them all. Two weeks later, Cologne, the Max Planck Institute for Plant Breeding Research, the new home to Chai's research. The city is so nice and small, he says. Yeah, I think I need to keep moving. I need to, you know, get a new environment and take some more challenge. Coming over here, you know, we have very, you know, closer collaboration with many scientists over here. No protein, no life and no immune defense. Chai's exact descriptions of the structures provide such essential discoveries on the shape of the molecules that they are being used to develop medication for humans and animals but are also relevant to the control of plant pests. There are a lot of genetics data regarding, you know, immune response. But structurally, essentially, we know little, if not nothing. Chai shows how the molecular structure of certain proteins really looks. We know how immune defense works in cells. We often even know which genes are responsible but how it exactly works and how certain proteins interact with the receptors, this is mostly unknown. With Gigi Chai's Humboldt professorship and his expertise, the new cryo-electron microscopy will come to the Max Planck Institute and the University of Cologne, and further strengthen these leading research facilities. I think this at least offers me an opportunity to, you know, to explore some new field like some new topics. 
Exploring new areas in structural biology, in uncharted terrain. His wife will join him in their new home in a few months. His other great love, the passion for science, is always with him. I just want to know, you know, how or why. Because with the structure of this, this data, you are, at least, you know, I think you are the first one in the world to know the unknown, 